Right, the first part of this video, before we go on to that monstrous setup there, is uh, a sort of replication of a video I saw the other day, um, where a guy was showing how uh, the collapsing fields within coils um, work. So what we've got is a transformer here with uh, two inputs and four outputs. You have an LEDs positive on either end and the negatives go on the two middle ones. When you put the battery and I'm going to do this put the battery, put the uh, there's a negative terminal positive one is now ready to go on when you put it to the battery you can see that the lights flash what you have is the green is the charge up and the red is when you take the battery contact away and you can see how that works I hope but anyway in which case it's a one and a half volt LED circuit very simple indeed you can see how that works and the flash alternate like that, the green as it uh, powers up and the red as the power is removed ok, here's the circuit running, I didn't rip it all down in the end, I've uh, been experimenting a bit more with it um, what I wanted, oh, I've got a 2N2222 on there now that was on its own little circuit board and I found it on some junk electronics and ah, it seems to run the circuit pretty well the input voltage 3.13 volts and now we've got this little device from before with one leg, with one connection going to this side of this coil and the other one spare at the moment the coil runs in line with these coils here which are the multi strand coils which are doing the powering so what we've got is a discontinuation of one of the lines going through this coil now if I pick up this and attach it you can see both LEDs are on so it's showing the power cycles the charging up, the collapsing which I thought was quite a good little tester idea now interestingly enough you see the 3.13 there if I connect this so that the lights are on look at the voltage reading all over the place I don't know what causes that but uh, oh yeah and over here we've got well 10,000 UF capacitor showing the output through the LED if I turn it up the rotor slows so obviously I want that to speed up instead at some point and if I turn it back again the rotor will slowly pick up speed again but anyway the main demonstration I guess is this uh, showing the fields and showing how the both LEDs will light up okay thanks for watching